Hey guys, and welcome back to Resident Evil Director's Cut. Now, we've had two very unfortunate, unsuccessful attempts against Yawn. One was because we were uh, experimenting. Actually, before we go do Yawn, we still do have a key. A key that needs to be used up. Um, yes, so, very unfortunate uh, turn of events. I don't want to fight Yawn. I think running past the bastard is the best course of action. Um, I also had a quick experiment the other day with the mode um, that was mentioned to me that gives you extra ammo. Um, and, <laughs> man, it's quite a lot of fun, actually. And I am thinking maybe we should run this game in that mode, because it's still a ranged mode. And I think it's still hard. You just get a fucking bucket of ammo. Like, every ammo pickup is doubled. So, you know, uh, pretty much at the beginning of the game... Um, when I got to the first save room, I had 118 bullets, I think. And obviously, boxes of shotgun shells come in packs of 14 instead of uh, 7. And magnum rounds as well come in packs of 12 instead of 6. And same with grenade ammo. And I was thinking, maybe, for shits and giggles, that would make a fun, um, a fun little LP. Uh, anyway, let's continue because I want to do more Resident Evil on this channel. I want to do a lot more Resident Evil on this channel. I think it would be fun. So, that's kind of exactly what we're going to do. A carving of armor. Do we not have... Why did I put the armor key back? If you answered because you're stupid, you're correct. You're absolutely correct. Uh, and it could have something to do with the fact that I've just come back from work as well. And like an idiot, I left my slim PlayStation on. Because um, I've been... <laughs> I re-greased the, the mechanism. And uh, ironically, when I was playing without recording last night, I played for about, I don't know, yeah, it must have been a good hour or so. Uh, it was fine. It ran absolutely fine. So now I'm recording. It's decided that it can't read the disc anymore. Uh, very tempted to buy a new PlayStation 2. Strip it apart, get a custom case on it and all that good stuff. Um, but at the moment... Games consoles, even old games consoles, are so expensive because of this lockdown. Uh, a PS2 used to run you, what, I don't know, £30, £40? Good luck, <laughs> is all I can say now. You look online and a PlayStation 2 is pushing nearly £100. It's like, yeah, no, 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 no. It's expensive at half that price, my dude. And especially PlayStation 2s as well, because they were hammered, man. Like, crazy. It's not like a, a, a Dreamcast or, or something. Where you, I mean, they're not very reliable anyway. But a Dreamcast is, um, yeah, a machine that wasn't on the market very long. Didn't get a lot of use. And, you know... Apart from the fact that they are inherently unreliable, as I found out to, to <laughs> quite a few times now, um, you know, you know, it's going to be in fairly good nick. And I would even wager the same for the Wii U. I have a Wii U down there, and it's in like the, a friend actually got me last year for my birthday, and he bought it in a job lot of stuff, and it's literally brand new. It's perfect. The only problem with it is the actual gamepad battery is doesn't last very long anymore. It lasts about an hour and a half. Uh, apparently they're supposed to last nearly four hours when they were new. Um, and replacement batteries are either garbage or they don't exist uh, because Nintendo doesn't make them anymore, which is stupid because unlike most portable devices that will take a charge if the battery is not installed um, so they're still usable, the gamepad is not. 
if there's no battery or the battery is dead, the gamepad won't work. So Nintendo actually built in a death clock into the Wii U because I'm not sure you can use the system without the gamepad. So we can only hope that the quality third-party manufacturer down the line starts producing new batteries for them. But the Wii U sold so terribly that that's rather unlikely. And it's a shame. It, it is a shame. I hate it when machines become obsolete in for stupid ways like that. Totally artificially placed uh, death clock. Anyway, enough of that tangent. Uh, I do waffle on about some shit, don't I? Anyway, let's have a little look inside. I have no idea what's in... Well, no, that's not true. I do kind of know what's in this room. Or this, this collection of rooms. Because I've seen... Ooh, I've seen it. Ooh! We got hardcore lucky there. I know there's a lot more Zeds in here because I'm pretty sure uh, in the standard version there is four... No, <laughs> four zombies. There's uh, one, and he's around this corner. Yeah, man. Look at this tasty hunk of meat right here. And she's all yours, if you can get around the Beretta. But you can't. This game is being very good to us when it comes to um, critical hits, which is pretty fucking fantastic. So what have we got? And uh, I have been getting very lucky when it comes to critical hits. Although... Uh, when I replayed... Oh, why am I trying to put shotgun shells in that? That would be interesting. Um, yeah, when I tried to play this game... Oh, or when I replayed up to the part where we died, uh, we didn't get so lucky the second time. Um, a lot of bullets used. Now, this is different. Pretty sure that's a different camera angle. Originally, in this room, he's dead. There was just... One zombie on the ground. Uh huh. Now I know we have nothing major. Oh, is there no crawly crawly zombie? I guess not. Now well, we've got a couple of herbs, which will definitely stuff those into our back pocket. Come on, PlayStation. See, it's working better, but it's not perfect. I have seen a new laser for this um, PlayStation 2, but it's. Yeah, it's from China, from AliExpress, which is fine, but the delivery date is, is crazy. It's something like up to 40 days to be delivered. Ugh, and it's only a tenner as well, which ain't bad. And I do really prefer to... Let's have a look in here. I do really prefer to repair a console if I can and throw it away, because I just... I hate e-waste. And look at this, guys. And I generally just enjoy. Um, let's have a look. There's one outfit that fits you perfectly. So this is where we can swap our outfits. So let's have a little look at this, shall we? Oh, my other option was to pick up a PlayStation 3. Because I don't have a PlayStation 3. I have all the other PlayStations. And my... God, PlayStation 3 is expensive at the moment as well. And a pain in the dick to uh, report from. Um, ooh, I, I've never seen that outfit before. I do like the Made in Heaven outfit for um, our friend Chris. That's cool. Yeah, I quite like that. Okay, what other outfits have we got for her? We've got her, like, original outfit, I think. Right, can we have... It does not fit. And there's one outfit that fits you perfectly. Will you change your outfit? Yes. Now, I like the knife on the chest. That's cool. That's uh, very reminiscent of Claire from Resident Evil 2. Don't know why she had the knife on the chest, to be honest. Um, I, I don't know the legality of that in America. Is that legal? Can you just go around with a combat knife uh, attached to your chest? I, I mean, 
<laughs> I always thought that was quite funny. Okay, so that's not actually the outfit I wanted. That's her original outfit, which is cool. I like it. I like it a lot, but no. No. Um, so they're obviously Chris's two outfits. Very cool that he has the knife there as well, like his sister. I like that. Uh, made in heaven as well. Oh, I like that so much. That's so cool. Anyway, let's swip. Swip, switch up to this uh, outfit here, which is a little bit more casual. Not as stupid as her Resident Evil 3 outfit. Which, don't get me wrong, I like it. I like that outfit. It's awesome. The short skirt and the boob tube. Very, very much a product of its time. You could tell that's straight out of the late 90s. But it's stupid because Jill's not an idiot and there is no way she would be wearing that uh, if the zombies came knocking. You know, <laughs> if Nemesis comes knocking. She would be, I think, a little bit smarter. I think she would be wearing some prop a proper like leather jacket. Uh, leather's very hard to bite through. I've tried. Um... Very, very hard to bite through. Um, and some thick padded combat jeans. or Combat jeans? Combats or, you know, cargo shorts, I believe the Americans call them. That sort of thing. There's a lot of flesh uh, on show, which is fine for, you know, casual scenarios. But when you're dealing with the, uh, the, the hungry dead, uh, I don't think that's wise. Oh, that's cool. Very cool. I like the top. Again, very much product of his time. Very much so. Uh, right. I did also, when we had loads of ammo, check that room out. Kill that zombie in there. There's nothing in there apart from the magazine that we found previously. Which was cool. Now, <laughs> have I delayed this confrontation enough? Right, I guess we're going to go see our buddy Yawn. But let's go to the, do we need to go to the item box or are we okay? Uh, we've got a couple of herbs on us. We've got shotgun shells to pick up. We've got shotgun shells to pick up. Uh, I can't remember if uh, I did the other bits, actually. Map. Um... There we go. So, yeah, okay, so it looks like we've done all the other bits then. Hmm. <laughs> so we just have to go see Mr. Yawn himself, uh, which is fine. So that means we've got shotgun shells and one other pickup. You know what? We'll, we'll, we'll not bother with the item box for now. Uh, we're going to save our acid rounds as <laughs> I've been zipped off many, many, many times now to save them for the hunters and uh, basically things that are more of a threat. And we forgot the key. We, we do not have the key. Man, can you tell that I've just literally had 11 hours at work in the hot sun brushing and digging? And then literally come straight home and start recording this. Uh, my missus is starting a new job-ish today. So I have an evening to myself, which I've never had since we've been together. Or um, uh, since we've lived in this house, which is like seven or eight months now. So it's a bit strange. <laughs> it just feels weird being home this late and, and she's not here. Um, but I'm going to... Take advantage of it and get some recording done. Right, okay, so let's slap those together. I'm very tempted to save the game, but... Oh, I don't see the point. Right, um, I'm, I do see the point. It's going to be a pain in my fucking ass if this doesn't work. And I get killed again. Which... Uh, yeah, I, I could totally, 
Did I take the key? Did I take the key? My brain has just dribbled out through my ass. And there's an image for you guys. A rather horrific image. Hell, there's an image for me that I'm not a fan of. Um, now. Come on, where's the key? I saw it. I literally saw it. Don't you be teasing me, game. Don't you, don't, there we go. Don't you tease me like that, game. You're not too old that uh, I won't put my foot up your ass. Although maybe you are because I don't really want to buy another copy of this game. Although I do want another copy of this game. At least I want a new PlayStation game box, which they're crazy money now. Why? You know, collecting games used to be a bit of a hobby of mine. But then all the fucking... Ho Scalpers and shit just took all the fun out of it. Is there a game that... I mean, some PlayStation games I've seen go for 150 plus pounds. Are they worth it? No. No game is. Oh, forgot about him. Evening there, Chief. I don't got time to play with you. So here we are, 16 minutes into the video. And we're... <laughs> I was going to say we're going to get some new content, but we're not really going to get some new content because we're probably going to run up here and get killed by Yawn. This video should be called something like 10% new content, or I don't know. My brain is sleeping. Shh, sleepy brain. Right, here we go. Oh, God. Um... Shit. Okay. I don't know how Jill knows that that key is now useless, but we're going to roll with it. And once more, we step into the jaws of death. Okay. Okay. Come on, you bastard. Come on. You ugly, smelly bastard. Ooh, uh, 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 oh, fuck, fuck. Run, 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 run. Jill, remember your training, and you will make it back alive. Maybe, I don't know. There's no guarantee in this game. Uh, run. Right, hopefully. Ooh, fuck you, yawn. Yes, you can have a nibble. You can have a little cheeky nibble of Jill's flesh. But that's all you're getting today, a nibble. Aha! Yes, yes, that's what we're talking about. Fuck you, snake boy. Fuck you. Smell you later, literally. And we got poisoned, but that's okay. Oh, God, that actually went pretty bloody well give me the serum who you talking to Jill I love the way she collapses it's like a sack of spuds all right Barry you're gonna do me a solid are you and dig me out of this fire you're a legend you're one of the best oh, I love this music listen to that Listen to that. Oh my god. It's so good. I like uh, Jill's shoes as well. I like she's wearing Vans or something. Don't. Well, Barry was here, but I think he's buggered off for now. Um, does that mean we now have all the crests? I kind of hope so. Because... Uh, if we don't... We've run out of mansion to explore. Um, which means... Um, okay. 
We're going to take the shells. And we're going to put them all together. Because I need to really uh, manage this inventory, but I'll do that off camera. Uh, I kind of got a bit sloppy with it because I got really pissed off by having to keep doing the game. Well, not pissed off. That's not accurate. Uh, oh, more shelves. Oh. 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 We're, we can bath in the shells. Holy bugger nuts. Me like. Right, okay. So we're going to drop these down. Uh, greens. Put the green. Put the green. Put the mixed. Oh man, yeah, okay. I don't, yep. Do not like this inventory. Definitely need to have a little fiddle with that. Uh, right, Suncrest. Where are you other slippery little buggers? There you are. There you are! Mooncrest. Right, so we can get out of this mansion. Which is good. Um, probably don't need to be lugging around boxes of shotgun shells. Or a singular, singular box of shotgun shells. So 28. Okay, we're looking good. We're looking good. We've got like 35 odd shotgun shells. Which is very healthy. Not as healthy as it could be. You understand. But that's not bad. Okay, so let's go. We're going to go down this way. This way we don't have to sneak past the zombie. Not really sure which is actually the fastest way would have been to sneak past the zombie, go up and around, but I don't want to risk getting bitten, to be honest. And I don't think there's a huge amount in it anyway. Now, looking forward to getting to the guard house. I think they called it the guard house, didn't they? I can't remember what it was called now. That's where I believe we're going to get a difficulty spike. Come on, PlayStation. There we go. So weird. All you got to do is eject the disc. And, well, open the cover and put it back and it works fine. That is uh, confusing me. I'm getting old. I get confused easily, apparently. All right. Now, I know out here we're going to have a butt-ton of dogs to face. But... They're only there until we make our return journey. So, do we fight the dogs? Or... Hmm... I mean, fighting the dogs is dangerous anyway because we're Jill and we're squishy. Uh, if there is a right answer to that string of questions, I don't know what it is. But we're going to find out together. I'm thinking, again, dangerous, I know, but I am considering running past them. I really am. But I want to pick up the herbs that are there as well. Technically, on the return journey to the mansion, all we need to pack is a shotgun. Possibly a health item. But, yeah, we, we've got... We've got Mr. Smiley out here. Um, do I want to save the game? I don't know. I think... No, he's not dead. He's dead. What have we got? We've got 52 rounds. But, fuck it. YOLO. Do the kids still say YOLO? I don't know. Or did all the kids that said YOLO pass on? Right. Don't know how many dogs we've got here. I think it's two. Yeah. Right, he's gone. Okay, they're both gone. We, again, lucked out hardcore there. Is it just two? I don't trust it. 
We have, yeah, okay, it's just two. We have so many dogs to deal with. Let's see, off the top of my head, I think we have five. Between us and the next save room, I could be wrong. There could be more. I think I'm lowballing that. Which is bad. We don't really want to be lowballing that number. I am concerned. But we do need to grab us up the crank. If there's ammo in here, I... Come on, Jill. Come on. Don't make me... No, you're going to make me run around the side, aren't you? And push it back. Yeah, so... Uh, uh, no. If there's ammo in this room, I don't know about it. I don't think there is. There we go. Beautiful. Alright, let's get this over here. Grab the crank. Go play with the crank. And then... We can worry about uh, the dogs. Oh, God. Oh, man. I don't want to... See, in the remake, this room had a first aid spray in it. had some shotgun shells in it and a grenade, I think. Haven't played the remake for years, mind. Here we go. Here we fucking go. Let's grab as many of these herbs as we can. Which actually, by the look of it, I think we can grab all of them. There are some blue herbs just around the corner. Which... We don't really want to play with. Uh, I, I'm hoping we're not going to need them. But again, I don't know. I have no idea what we need and what we don't. Now, as long as we don't run... Oh, fuck it. Got no choice. Weapons free, Jill. Weapons free. Got lucky. Come on, you bastard. There should be three here. Oof. Come on. Come to mama. Yeah, get the fuck out of here, Fido. Right, good stuff. Okay, apparently... Oh, God, hang on. Apparently, uh, there's a lot of dog murder in... This is Jill. This is Brad. Stars Alpha Team. Bravo Team. It doesn't matter. Anybody, answer me. This is Brad. Hmm. I think it's on the fritz, Jill. Brad? Brad? Either that or Brad's pretending not to listen. Okay, uh, yeah, so there's a lot of dog murder in uh, The Last of Us Part 2, which apparently has gone up on a advert for the game. And uh, apparently it's quite graphic and gruesome. I don't know how I... I... Killing people and humans, uh, you know, sounds bad, but women, children, blah, 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 whatever. I don't care. But killing animals in a very graphic way, I I don't really like that. I, f I think it's a bit strange. I don't know why they, they, they needed to put that in. But hey, uh, mm, that's already uh, a very controversial game. I, I've, seen, I've seen a lot of it that's been spoiled for me. I haven't watched any uh, of the game videos or anything, but, but a lot of that game has been spoiled for me. And, oof, oh dear, <laughs> mm. <laughs> uh. am I going to get the game and play it? Yes. Am I looking forward to it? No, but 
I want to know what happens. And it'd be nice to sit down with the missus and play the second one. Uh, after we played through the first one together. Right, so... Those dogs were not too bad. They were not bad at all. The water is running down the opposite side. Ah, Jill, your powers of deduction are exemplary. This is why you're a great detective. You're not a detective, you're stars. You don't really know what stars are. Some sort of super cops, I guess. Um, too small of a team to be the SWAT team. And they're not exactly a paramilitary force, are they? So, I'm not really sure. Anyway, let's go down. Avoid these danger noodles, which aren't that dangerous. And we should have a couple of dogs to deal with. And some more herbs. But we'll come back for the herbs. You know, considering we can fit... Oh, God, I forgot about this bit. Fuck. Okay. Yep. Yeah. I forgot about this bit. Um, right. Okay. We're locked on. Uh, we're really low on bullets. I mean, we're really low on bullets. But dogs are trouble. Uh, don't even have two magazines left. Shit. Okay. Not happy about that, but we kind of needed to clear the way. So there's at least two more dogs through this way, I think. I mean, at least two more dogs. Oh, God. There's one down. Oh, God, come on. Fuck, he's around the... Ooh, here he comes. Oof. Okay. okay, there's three here, because so I can hear another one. Come on, you bastard. Come get me, baby. Oh, you... You shit. You little shit. Right. Okay. We're going to get hit here, aren't we? Nope. Okay, we lucked out. Seriously lucked out here. But we might have to bring Mr. 12 Gauge with us. Okay, fuck you. Uh, right, so we've got access to those herbs now. And, oh, God, okay. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute, there might be some more dogs out here, but no. Right, so we've got access to those herbs out the front, um, which is good. And there's some more herbs in front of us, I think, but I think they're just blues. My memory might be, yeah, they're just blues. Okay, cool, that's fine. Well, let's get this statue where it needs oh oh have they have they changed where the hole is i mean hmm confused oh well let's go have a little look shall we so we need to push that a little bit further out I swear you didn't need to push it this far out before. But hey, what do I know? Alright, let's try that again. There we go. Is that... Oh! Right! There's more holes. Um... I th thought there bloody well was. That's sly. You cheeky bastards. 
Well, let's hit up the save room anyway. Um, we've got some grenade rounds, which... Eh, take them or leave them, I suppose. Um, apparently we can't take them with us, which... Okay, that's fine. I forgot our pockets were full. Herbs take up a lot of space, don't you know? Right, so... Let's... Green... Ink ribbon, green, green, uh, green, blue, blue. Okay, so we've got a lot of health here. Uh, it's not going to stay. Oh, we still got those greens and whatnot. Oh my god, we, yeah. Why am I worried about how many saves we take? We've got so many. Right, we don't need the crank anymore. Um, we could use some bullets. Lighter, we don't need. Uh, acid rounds. Acid rounds. Do we not have any normal rounds? I guess not. That's odd. Do we not have normal bazooka ammo? I could have sworn we had some. Surely that means we've missed some. Ah, oh, bollocks. Well, we don't need that for a hot minute. And I think we will take the head splitter for now. Anyway, guys. Uh, I'm going to drop a save because we've been playing for 30 odd minutes. We do have obviously some standard grenade rounds there, but that's not going to last forever. Um, hmm. And we'll take that as well. The FA spray, will we need it? Probably. Yeah. Uh, if nothing else, it will be useful against the tyrant. That much is for sure. Um, um, when we come back, I guess, I guess we are going to explore this area. Now, uh, we've been very lucky with the RNG. Uh, Jimmy did not get very lucky with the RNG. I mean, we have been getting zombie headshots fairly often. I don't know what the percentage chance for that shit is, but... We've really lucked out. Uh, and it saved our ass a few times. Jimmy Fails had a lot more issues than we have so far. Uh, at least playing with uh, Chris. It looked like the enemies seem to just take more ammo. So I guess we've, apart from Yawn, we have been lucky. Anyway, guys, I'm going to end it here. So thank you very much for watching. And as always, 